you know, I almost didn't want to stand up and say anything because there, I understand the place of where, where folks are coming from here. But I do want to bring attention to the fact that across the country and across our great state, folks are celebrating pride season right now, which means that there's celebrations that, bring, that recognize the diversity of our communities. And they're made up of people that try to make themselves and their families visible to our state because there are unique challenges that, that LGBT families face. These bills, this bill, while potentially well-intentioned, provides window dressing to discrimination. And, and I don't fault the sponsors. Uh, I, I trust the best place where the sponsor's coming from. But at the end of the day, this is a bill that says to some people who are receiving taxpayer support from our state that they don't get the same service as others. This places the interests of the agency over the child, and ultimately it is embarrassing for our state. When, we, when you listen to the testimony that occurred in the debate in the Senate, folks called these bills embarrassing. I would urge that we vote no on concurrence, that we put this conversation to rest, that we find ways that protect freedoms and liberties of all the agencies while not discriminating individual groups. This bill is not ready, this concurrence is not warranted, and I would urge that we vote no to end the process here. Thank you, Representative.